In this integration question, the integrand is x over 1 minus x cube whole under the root. So little observation and some manipulation is required to solve this question. What I'm going to do is there is x to the power 3 in the denominator and there is also root along with it. Though it cannot be root cannot be separated in with both these terms, but I'm going to put x to the power 3 by 2 is equal to t. This is going to be my substitution. So when we differentiate both sides with respect to x, I'm getting 3 by 2 x to the power 3 by 2 minus 1 dx is equal to dt. Now 3 by 2 minus 1 is 1 by 2. x to the power 1 by 2 simply means square root of x. So this becomes 3 by 2 square root of x dx is equal to dt. So this way I'm getting the value of root x dx is equal to 2 by 3 dt. Now in the integral I have root x in the numerator. So this root x dx can be substituted by 2 by 3 dt and in the denominator I have root 1 minus x cube which is root 1 minus what is x cube. Now x to the power 3 by 2 is equal to t. So if I square both the sides I am getting x 3 by 2 multiplied by 2 is x cube only. So value of x cube is equal to t square. So this is t square. So my integral has simplified beautifully. So this becomes 2 upon 3 dt and in the denominator I have 1 minus t square. Now integral of sine inverse t, derivative of sine inverse t is 1 upon root 1 minus t square. So integral of 1 upon root 1 minus t square is going to be sine inverse t. So this becomes 2 over 3 sine inverse t plus c. To get the final answer, let's back substitute the value of t. So t is x to the power 3 by 2. So this becomes x to the power 3 by 2 plus so 2 by 3 sine inverse x to the power 3 by 2 plus c is the final answer.